All right, guys, how we doing? Hopefully, y'all can hear me all right. Uh, if you'll just let me know in the uh, chat section there. Um, been kind of having a hard time with Twitch the past two days, so let me know if y'all can hear me, and then we will get rocking. <clears throat> Sweet man, Mr. J and Harley. How you doing, guys? Thanks for hopping in here so quickly. Um, all right, so we've done a little bit. Uh, we played, I've been kind of hooked to be honest with y'all. Um, uh, played yesterday and planned on streaming last night, but uh, wasn't able to get it going. So tonight we got it going, we got the sound back over to Twitch. And, uh, yeah, been messing around with it for best part of two to three hours. So, I uh, don't have very long to stream. Got to get up early with the kids. So, um, we'll get to it. Uh, I'll show you real quickly where we are headed. So, we are leaving Salem, going up, it looks like, to the top of Portland. Um... Yeah, Portland Cargo Center. Um, kind of looks like it might be a little bit tight, but we'll see when we get up there. Did see a couple things when I went to pick up the load that uh, said I might have some problem with technical turns and stuff like that. But guys, I am uh, <clears throat> using Vipers uh, three seventy nine, three eighty nine mod. And uh, there is another mod. You guys can see I've got an extra axle on the actual uh, truck itself, drive axle. That is on the workshop as well if you guys are interested in this uh, chassis. I plan on going on the Salem shop. I did buy that shop because it seems like they got a lot of heavy loads. I plan on having that be like my uh, heavy truck center, I guess, where the other one... Uh, I forgot the freaking name of it. Either way, we'll be uh, like logging in dirt and stuff like that. So, mini me, what is up? Let's go trucking. Absolutely, man. Let's get it. truck is actually uh, quite a bit overkill for what we're hauling, but it's what was available. So yeah, did a little bit of dressing up to uh, some of the other trucks. Seems like uh, just about 60 to 70 percent of my time on ATS is customizing. The other part's driving. I don't know. I just like... I like messing with the trucks. Get them dressed up and then see something you like and change it up a little bit more. Wait, squeeze there.
I was messing with you, <laughs> Mr. J. No, I didn't even uh, didn't even put two and two together there. Having the big case on the back and parked next to that uh, apple orchard. There might have been a field on the other side. The uh, side that was uh, what on my left was apple orchard. The side to my right might have been a field. I didn't even look. Trying to get everything squared away with the uh, the stream. Must be why so many people jumped in right off the bat. I think we were up to 10 or 12. I didn't really think about that. I guess I should have uh, looked at my surroundings. Pretty sad when you gotta do that, but the title should have threw some people off, I guess. I hope you're not disappointed. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's good. I appreciate that, man. No, I've been enjoying this, to be honest with you, man. It's just uh, not much thought to it. Farm sim, there's not too much either, but when it gets so repetitive, I just try to, uh, I try to think about something doing something different or trying to do something different with uh, you know what we're always doing with the logging and stuff like that it's pretty pretty cut and dry I mean sometimes during the, uh, the stream something can go awry and you know it gives us a little bit of a little bit of excitement or you know throws a little wrench into it but I don't know. Um, be completely honest with you. Uh, my my Columbus Day probably tomorrow will be uh, getting everything winterized, getting the house all ready, and you know that type of deal. Not really uh, too much planned. Be staying. Yeah, it looks like we're gonna be. Well, maybe not. How about you, buddy? Anything uh, exciting going on?
I got you. Throw your feet up a little bit, absolutely. Well, if I get some time tomorrow, maybe I'll uh, do what I can to get a video going for uh, the other channel. I don't really have too much that I can really record, though. I mean, probably gonna be a lot of driving type of deal. I'm gonna have to push you over, Buck. Sorry about that. Ah, uh, video. If I get a chance, that's that's the biggest thing. Um, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see about a stream. <clears throat> Wife works late tomorrow, so I don't know. Usually Mondays and. Mondays, Tuesdays, got to cut over again, going to have to push everybody over, really like that ramp very much, uh, Monday, Tuesdays, and Thursdays are very hard days for me to stream because my wife usually gets home around 8 o'clock, and the kids I, I put to bed around 7.30, and one of them, the other one goes to bed around 8.30, so kind of hard. Usually I like to be in bed by 9, 30, 10 o'clock. What's up, Ryan? How you doing, buddy? Yeah, that's why it's going to be a, uh, shoot, i got to be in that lane. I really screwed this up. Try to push these guys over a little bit here. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, yeah, no, I just got uh, got started late tonight. But I knew I wanted to try to get something going. And I wanted to try out this new, uh, new build. After this white car, it's mine. Very good. Yeah, I'm spoiled working with the state. Them yellow lights.
get us out of a lot of trouble with crossing yellows and whites and stuff like that because our trucks are uh, all outfitted with overweight and over width permits. So I do have some bad habits. <clears throat> audio bug is really kind of annoying. Movie Venom, huh? Haven't heard of that one. Was it pretty good? Good, I'll have to check it out. I think I got a USB port going out. Every now and then, my USB will, uh, I don't know if you guys heard that sound or not, but my shifter, or my actual, uh, a high low range on my shift knob keeps going out. Ah, uh, better Venom from Spider-Man 3. Don't movie. Oh. Very cool. <clears throat> See what the job market has for us up here. There's a nice one. 66,000 that uh, case. What the freak do you call that? Quad track? I think it was 55,000. We'll pick that up. Still not the weight that I want, but... We'll get to it. We'll find it one of these days. 